welcome to the second part of the kind of mini series I'm doing where I make accessories for the Lego City 60287 tractor that came out earlier this year. I already made a trailer, tipping trailer, some bale spikes, you saw that, and pallet full. Now I have a couple of bales. A kind of cultivated power and everything, I don't really know what it turned into. And the bale trailer. So let's have a look at the two bales, because they are pretty simple. They, um, yeah, they have technic holes in them, which are offset. Because then they can fit the spikes, which are awkwardly five studs apart. I didn't really like that. However, it does fit in. It doesn't go all the way in. But it goes on a fair bit, and then you can lift it up. They are quite heavy, however, so the loader can't hold them up. Which is a bit unfortunate. But... No, I'm quite happy with the odd power harrow thing. I don't really know what I was going with with this. I made this actually quite a while ago. Um, probably about a couple of months ago now. But I didn't make anything else, so I was waiting to make some more things to do another video. This, um, yeah, I'm going to call it a power harrow. Although I would like these sides to be covered. But it fits onto the track, so I'm... In this hole here, I made use of that. So it just fits in there. It's not a perfect connection because it can move in a few funny ways and it does look a bit derpy. But it's okay. And also, I replaced this 1x2 dark grey brick here with one with two technic holes in it. And then used one of the friction pins and one of the non-friction pins. Which meant I could have hose adapters and that's what these are supposed to represent. And I used two different colours to have two different spool valves. So, yeah. I mean, it doesn't look great. But... Uh, yeah, it's okay. Mm, yeah. Personally, I'm more happy with the bales, but you know, it works. Finally, I have the bale trailer, which unfortunately, when it's off the tractor, it does actually sit with the rear wheel off the ground. Um, I was trying to find a way to put a stand on it, but this tractor's actually really bad for how tight the wheels are to the hitch. So when you steer with anything wide at all, it just catches the wheels and then you can't turn. So I just had to go for this design. It does have another cable on it. Drips and maybe braking cable or lights cable. It does have lights on it. However, it does not have um, a license plate because I could not find a, a stickered license plate piece. But I'm about to part out some sets, so I'll get one from that and put it on it. It's um, built off a very, <laughs> very uh, Heath Robinson chassis. It does use a Lego like, City car base in it at one point just to give it a bit more strength. But. Uh, I'm quite happy with it. It was uh, originally going to be red. <laughs> I was planning to make it red to kind of match this trailer to kind of have them by the same in game. In game? In game. No, in universe company. But when I realised I didn't have enough red base plates to make this, um, I just went for a completely different colour scheme with a dark grey chassis and a green top. So I think this is where it's supposed to be something like a Marshall or maybe a Bailey something along those lines but it does work with the bales it actually works with the bales quite well because you can get uh, stick here. I wouldn't I'm not going to push them down because I don't think I'll ever get them back up but I'll take two wide or four long yeah so if I had more bales yeah. it's two studs extra length either way but it could also take pallets some normal Lego City style pallets here. So it could take four of them, four of them, three of them long, which, you know, that's not bad. So I'm quite happy with it. And then you could use the pallet fork to load the pallets, but I had last time. So, yeah. I'm quite happy with this lot. Give it away. Bale, bale, trailer, and odd power harrow thingy. Oh, it's slow down. Get some of those on. There we go. And then you can just catch it up. Which is incredibly close to the wheels. I think that might actually have to get extended slightly. And then also just... Oh, this is hard. Oh my word. There. Catch it up. And you know. Yeah. Got yeah, see, it struggles with turns. Let's try it again. And off we go. 